Welcome back to Shotoku Tech. So I will be revisiting the new firmware update in Platform IO for the TTGO TWOX 2020. I'll be doing that soon. There's a lot of comments on this video already that seem to be headed in the right direction. But in the meantime, I wanted to revisit Platform IO and try something a little simpler. And this particular website has a lot of great tips for the TTGO TWATCH. First of all, let's talk about fonts and images. So he points to a font converter website, and then he also points to an image converter website as well. And then he goes on to make his cat watch. So we're going to do the same thing, and we're going to make my friend's Fred Flintstone sundial watch. So DevOpsStar has given us this get command that we should just be able to copy and paste into a terminal in VS Core, and it will download a copy of the repository, CatWatch. But as you can see, I don't have get installed. So let's install get, and then I'm going to close and reopen VS Core, and then we can try again. I'm just accepting all of the defaults here. So I installed Git, and we're going to open Visual Studio Code again. I should be able to click on Git, say Clone Repository, take that gentleman's URL, and then I want to select a repository location. There we go. So we've opened it now. Okay, so this is taking me somewhere here. Here's our platform io.ini file. It's got everything I need there. Let's go into the source code. So you can see his CatWatch program. He's used these font converter and image converter websites to create his font and the picture of his cat. We're going to go to the LVGL website image converter and we're going to upload this cool little ping file I just made for this video. Okay, we're going to call it Fred underscore PNG and convert it. We're going to save that file. Okay, and I'm going to click in here and open the file location. We want to keep tabs of where that is. I'm just going to kind of restore these windows down. See, now what I want to do, you can right click and say reveal in file explorer. So this is showing me where to drop this file. So let's go back and get our file now. Fred Ping goes here. Copy here. So now all I really should have to do is do an include of Fred Ping. So let's see where the word cat is used and replace it. See, so we want to replace cat ping with Fred Ping. Okay, there's two locations. Oh, we're going to replace there. And let's go to the next location. Oh, it's up here. Okay. Yeah, okay. Now, okay, all the errors have cleared out. I just want to peek into this Fred Ping file because I had problems last time I was doing it, but it looks like it's done right here. Before it was appending the C on me. Just want to make sure all the declarations are correct. What I'm going to do is go File, Save All. Now, trust me, I did this the other day. I'm just going to close it and reopen it. I got to go grab my watch. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back and I'm hooking up my watch to my USB cable. And I'm just going to run the upload because that's what he says to do here. So he just basically says get his code from GitHub. And remember, I had to install the get extension in Platform.io. We're not changing the font. We've created our own Fred Flintstone image and placed that in the project. We've edited 
the file to reflect the inclusion of the Fred Flintstone ping. And there's a couple places in the code where that's referred to. There and there. So we're going to go ahead and send this to the watch. Here we go. Hopefully we won't get a bunch of massive errors. So again, cheers to DevOps star for this. And it looks like this is going to go through for me. There we go. It's loading. <laughs> and there's your Fred Flintstone sundial watch there, Carson. All right. Stay tuned and thank you very much. Give this video a like. Click down below for the links in the description. Click up here to subscribe and click over here to check out the TTGO playlist. Thank you very much. Thank you for watching Shotoku Tech. Please subscribe, comment, like, and share.